Hey everybody and welcome and this video is going to be a very affordable wash day from washing your hair to styling it. I'm going to show you some very affordable products that I like to use in my hair to get these ultra defined curls. Let's just get started. I'm starting my wash day in the shower. It's the quickest and the easiest for me to do. I will be using OGX's quenching coconut curls line and the first product in the line that I will be using is their shampoo so this was actually my first time using this product and as you can see this product is very thick at first I thought it was the conditioner and I had to double check but this is the shampoo and it applies so smoothly it feels amazing on my strands it's very moisturizing and hydrating this product does contain coconut oil sweet honey and citrus oil so if you are new here then you may not know that i shampoo my hair in sections that just causes me to get less tangles i am going to use a scalp brush as well just to make sure i'm getting any dirt and debris off my hair also, this product has a lot of slip. This is one of the few shampoos I have that actually has slip. If you like to detangle with your shampoo, you definitely can do that with this product. With this shampoo, even though it is moisturizing, it still did a great job cleansing my hair and I only needed to cleanse my hair once. Once I have rinsed my hair completely, my hair is nice and refreshed and my scalp is very clean. Next up from the line is their conditioner. This product isn't as thick as the shampoo. It's very creamy and smooth and it glides right on your strands immediately. I will take apart each twist and apply the conditioner to each section and make sure that this product is smooth through on my strands and this product has so much slip. It has amazing slip, incredible slip. My fingers were gliding right through. My hair was soaking up this product it felt really good on my strands. If you are looking for a conditioner that's gonna give you a ton of slip, very cheap, then this conditioner will be right up your alley because I was really impressed on how fast I was able to finger to tangle my hair. After that, I'm going to apply a shower cap and let this conditioner sit on my hair for a couple of minutes. And look at that shed hair. I barely got any shedding. Like I said, that detangling session was amazing. Even while rinsing out the conditioner, I can still feel the hydration in my strands. My hair feels moisturized, it feels soft, and my curls are clumping together. Now that I am out the shower, I'm going to be styling my hair. I am going to be using two products from the line. I like them both, so I decided to use one on each side just so you guys can see the difference and then you guys can pick which styler you would want. So on this side, I'm going to be using the Curling Hair Butter Leave-In or Rinse Out. So you can use this as a rinse out conditioner. You can use this as a leave-in or a hair butter. For me, I like using this as a leave-in slash hair butter. It works perfectly for that for me this product is very thick it's smooth and my hair really soaks up this product I'm going to apply a good amount of this product on the whole half side of my head I make sure to smooth this in thoroughly into my strands when I do this first I find that my hair doesn't dry out as fast so I like doing this step first before I twist my hair up this product is definitely my favorite from the line because I've been using this product the longest this is actually my third container of this product 
I forgot how much I love this product and I have so many other products and haven't picked this up from the store, but I definitely recommend this product, highly recommend. So for this style, I'm just going to do a simple twist out. I'm going to part off a medium size section in the back and apply a little bit more of that hair butter, smooth that through and twist it right up. You guys know how to do a twist out, I'm pretty sure. If you want a more detailed video, I'm gonna leave a video down below and in the cards. And I'm going to continue to repeat those same steps, parting off a medium size section, adding product, twisting it down. And if my ends get a little dry, I will add more product on my ends, coil them and the twist is set. This product is amazing. I love the way my curls feel. My hair is never weighed down. My hair absorbs this product very well. I do have low porosity and I do have fine to coarse strands. Twists are looking juicy, feeling very soft and hydrated. On the next side from the Quenching Coconut Curls line, I'm using their Frizz Defining Curl Styling Milk. So this product is just like the name states, it's a styling hair milk. So this product has slip, it clumps the curls very well, it's very defining. So if you want a more defined style, I would definitely go with this curling milk instead of the hair butter. My hair still felt soft with this product. I do recommend to apply more water on this side just to ensure that this product is being smooth through your strands and your strands are being coated very well. So like I said before, I'm applying this product all over my hair first and then I'm gonna break this section down into medium sized section, apply a little bit more product and then twist it up. What I really like about this product is how smooth it feels on my strands and how much definition I got. Now that I am completed, I'm gonna let my hair air dry until the end of the night, and then I'm going to apply a bonnet and let my hair set overnight. And this is the shed hair I got from finger detangling my whole head of hair. So this is two days later. I did add some oil to my fingertips and I'm going to start to separate fluff, get my hair big and voluminous. You guys know I love big hair, so I'm going to achieve that. <laughs> As you can see the side with the hair butter, I have definition, my hair is soft, my hair is moisturized, it's bouncy, and my hair feels amazing. I really do love that hair butter, I really, really do. On the other side, as you can see, my hair is separating a lot easier than the side I use the hair butter because that curl styling milk gives my hair a ton of definition and my curls just clump so well. So overall, both of these stylers work amazing if you're looking for products that are very affordable, very cheap, that's going to give you super moisture and definition. I highly recommend this line in general. It works great for my kinky hair. If you don't know which styler to choose, the butter or the hair milk, it all depends on your preference. If you want more definition while also keeping that softness, I do recommend that styling milk. But if you just want moisturized, bouncy curls, I do recommend the hair butter as well. So my hair is going on day seven. It's definitely wash day for me because I wash my hair weekly. I still have definition. If I just went in with the refresher spray, I could probably stretch the style for a couple more days, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm going to cleanse my hair and start my routine all over again. So I hope this video was helpful and open your eyes to some affordable products that work great for kinky natural hair. And I do understand that sometimes you do not wanna break the bank when it comes to taking care of your hair and this line will not cause a dent in your pockets. Keep in mind that these products do not replace my more natural and organic products. This line is a great line to use in between my more expensive products just so my products can stretch. 
Yes, this OGX line is moisturizing and softening, but my more natural and organic products can deeply penetrate my hair from the inside out. And I have found for me that over time, that is how I am able to maintain my health. So definitely give this line a try. My wash day was amazing and it lasted for a week. So I was really happy about that. You can find these products at pretty much any drugstore. I have even found these products at the supermarket. I hope you guys enjoyed. Give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.